You're watching Local 4, home of ClickOnDetroit.com. WTIV Local 4 News at 5 starts now. The one-year anniversary of his ascendancy, Pope Francis is asked by Congress to come to the United States and do something no pope has ever done. We'll tell you about that. We'll also look back at a year of change in the Catholic Church just ahead. As Catholics mark the one-year anniversary of his papacy, Pope Francis has received an open invitation to address a joint session of Congress. House Speaker John Boehner sent the invitation today. If the Pope accepts it, he would be the first Pope ever to speak in front of the American Congress. Meanwhile, the Pope's one-year anniversary has a lot of people in and out of the Catholic faith reflecting on a remarkable year at the Vatican. Roger Weber, live in southwest Detroit, with a look at how this Pope has impacted the people's perceptions of the church. Roger? Devin, I'm outside St. Anne's Parish, which was founded in 1701. Of course, it's part of a church that is 2,000 years old. Many critics say uh, it's a glacial change in the Catholic Church, but many think that Pope Francis is going to move the church in a new direction. One year ago, newly elected Pope Francis asked the faithful to bless him. On his first anniversary, he continued that theme by tweeting, please pray for me. Pope Francis has been a great thing for Catholicism. I think he's brought a lot of light back into the church. Devin Gack is a biology student at the University of Detroit Mercy and a Catholic. I know he's on Twitter and everything, and, you know, he's reaching out to young people and showing everyone that Catholicism is still cool. And like the Pope, Father John Staudenmeyer is a Jesuit. He's UDM's assistant to the president for mission and identity. He does tend to think of the culture of the Catholic Church as being a world culture rather than a European culture. The Pope's style is perceived as the biggest change, his humility, informality, and connection with the poor. He's moving the church beyond social issues like abortion, divorce, and gay marriage. Well, he has gone out of his way, Francis has gone out of his way to say, you cannot single out uh, the sexual morality issues as the central issues. You'd better be talking about poverty. Exactly what Pope Francis is willing or able to change about church teaching remains a mystery. But the way he leads is reinvigorating many Catholics. I'll be looking forward to seeing him around for a long time. <laughs> Lots of good media coverage for the Pope in his first year. Uh, People asked him recently what it's like to be depicted as some kind of a Superman, and he said uh, it's really offensive. He replied that he's just a normal person. In Detroit, I'm Roger Weber, Local 4. A fa rather famous painting of him looking like Superman on a wall. Oh, yeah. in Rome.